the sound of our world. Our world. On CNA.Asia. On Me Listeners. On Google Assistant. Play news from CNA. And on your radio. This is CNA 938. Understand Asia. Next, news and current affairs through the night. This is World Tonight. Good evening, I'm Rachel Yeo. Tonight's top stories, a vaccine developed by Oxford University and AstraZeneca has been found to be between 70 to 90% effective. It's also cheaper and easier to store. Indonesia hits a grim milestone of half a million COVID-19 cases as hospitals edge closer to its capacity in some provinces. India's Supreme Court takes four states to task over their handling of the COVID-19 pandemic. They will have to explain their outbreaks and what's being done to curb the virus. South Korea reimposes tougher restrictions with Seoul declaring an emergency. All nightclubs and bars will have to shut. Hong Kong records its highest daily caseload in three months. The government is warning of a worsening outbreak. I'm Paul Singh. Also tonight, Joe Biden set to name key members of his cabinet. The president-elect is pressing ahead with transition plans. The U.S. moves to restrict tech exports to 89 Chinese firms with alleged military ties. Another crucial step tonight in the development of a COVID-19 vaccine. An inoculation developed by Oxford University and AstraZeneca has been found to be between 70 and 90 percent effective, depending on the dose. The vaccine is also said to be cheaper and easier to store than the jabs being produced by Pfizer and Moderna.